Hi everyone, so today we are playing the Mummy Returns video game, just the first level really, um, in this game you get to pick as either, you know, you get to play as either Rick or Connell or Imhotep, quite actually like that if I'm honest, as, yeah, I mean you're, you're, you probably guessed this, this game isn't great, but I think that's a cool element, uh, I would like to do Imhotep's one at some point, but for now we're just going to play as Rick or Connell, okay, so let's get on with it. Six thousand years ago, a fierce warrior known as the Scorpion King led a great army on Six a years. to unite the known world. Closer to Though sort of like well, five thousand two hundred years ago. I won't keep interrupting, by the way. Um, this is more just a bit of fun. It's not me doing like I am. On death's door, the Scorpion King made a pact with the desert god. You know, I am uh, history lesson or anything. Anubis would let him live to conquer his enemies. He would surrender to Anubis, his immortal soul. The next year, the Scorpion King stormed northward with the army of Anubis. No power on earth could stop the supernatural warriors, and the Sumerians were crushed before them. But the Scorpion King's moment of victory was also his last. As the army of Anubis was returned once again to oblivion, the soul of the Scorpion King was banished to the underworld. See if I can turn up a little bit, it's a little bit quiet. Though thousands of years have passed since then, history has yeah, been it's repeating itself. According to the calendar of the ancients, the year of the scorpion is once again upon us. Though my old friends Rick and Evie, and now their son Alex, think only to spend their days in pursuit of knowledge and treasure, they will soon find themselves on the path of danger once more. Stumbling through the ruins of the ancient past, they uncover an accursed treasure that leads them to their destined place in the ultimate battle between good and evil. For the mummy returns. Ah, oh, that's the name of the game! Oh my god! It's so dark in here, Rick. And yet, it's all so familiar. Uh, tell me, Sweet Pea, if that this ancient temple has been sealed off from the world the best for voice, a thousand speak. years or so, why is there a burning torch right over there? Take your pick, darling. Could be grave robbers, treasure seekers, or just the eternal flame of the damned. Okay, right. As bad as this game is, I quite like the little, like, little sort of, like, nod to the camera there. That's fun. Although that voice actor for, for Brendan Fraser is not good. Now you're talking! I pick grave robbers. Can we go now? I can hardly make out a single heart. I promise I won't keep I, I promise I won't keep pausing it, but this is supposed to be Evie. This looks literally nothing like her. Hieroglyph. And yet something tells me I've seen this all before. As if in a dream. What? Sand? Scarabs? Scorpions? Darling, throw in an evil mummy or two, and you're basically describing our honeymoon. Scorpions? Where? Be careful, Alex. Oh, Mum, I'm always careful. There's <laughs> something to climactic. Alex, you <laughs> alright? I think so, but I fell down some kind of steep chute and I can't get back up it. Sorry I broke the temple, Mum. Oh, Alex, can you tell me where you are? Can you see anything? Uh, not much. I'm in a huge room, filled with giant statues, but I can't see much else. It's really dark in here. Don't worry, Alex. We'll be right there. We've got to find another way down there. Come on, let's go. Okay. I know the acting for the kid in the, in the film wasn't particularly great, and the English accent was awful, but that, like, takes it to just another level. Oh, what? Whoa, what? Wait, wait, what? Where did he come from? Was he just waiting for us? Like, he must have literally been watching us during the cutscene. <laughs> like, where was, where did he come from? Huh. I guess, wait, can I, no, because look, he couldn't have jumped, he couldn't have jumped up there. That's like a massive jump.
Oh, that's cool. You can light the things as you went by. Uh, in all honesty, I actually used to play this game when I was younger. Uh, well, basically, when I was younger, I'm going to do the thing I said I wasn't going to keep doing, pausing it. Um, when I was younger, so as you know, I had terrible taste in films. That also extended to games. I used to love this game when I was younger. Partly just because I loved The Mummy and The Mummy Returns, but, you know, it really is just one of the many, many bad straight to, like, you know, video game film tie-in things they, they were making. Uh, did I just... Oh, I just want to try something in a second. I think I just saw something. Okay, so... <laughs> I swear I just hit her. I just want to see if you can. Stop running away! No, stop it! Oh, I... All right, fine. All right. Yes, you can. You can. Yeah. I don't condone that, by the way. But it's quite funny. See. <laughs> okay. So what was through here? I want to like this. It's some sort of ancient crypt. Look, this chamber is the final resting place of a most beloved servant of the Scorpion King himself. Apparently he's some sort of guardian. Guardian of the keys, actually. And the rest is just a lot of the usual gibberish about how all who enter here will die a thousand deaths and... Gibberish? Hmm, maybe we should skip this room. Come on, we've got to find Alex. <gasps> Convenient. What the? They are introducing mummies very quickly in this game. Oh, that was badly done. <laughs> oh, okay. You can chop off bits of them. Is this the Scorpion King? It's very quick. It can't be. I don't say he's the least frightening villain I've ever seen. Oi. Stop it. <laughs> I, I'll stop doing that now. Oh, so we're back up here. Why can I not just go down there? Like, well, I reckon you could get down there. Oh my, I wonder if anything will go wrong if I jump down there. Boy, I don't think so. Yeah, what? Okay, you cannot kill him that way. Jump, jump, jump. Get out, get out! Okay. They don't seem to be poisonous, so I scared. Unbelievable! The chamber of the Scorpion King. Whew, I hate to think what's in there. Mom! Dad! I'm in here! Is that you? Of course he is. You've got to get me out of here! Alex, hang on. We'll hurry. It won't budge. All right. Let's try it your way. Can you read the instructions on this thing? There's something here about four keys. 
No, no, not keys exactly. Four immense rubies that act like keys. We've got to place them into this cartouche, and the Scorpion King will be appeased and let us enter. There. That doesn't sound so bad, Alex. We'll just go take a look around for those rubies and come directly well, back for you. All right. Didn't Let's we do find one in the room with the... I love way, I don't know, maybe it's just because I, I used to play quite a lot of games, but I feel like I already know this is going. There's going to be four bosses, and they're all going to drop an emerald. We've got, well, a ruby, and we already got one of them, so I'm guessing I've just got to walk over here. And, yeah. <laughs> I'm not just guessing that, by the way, like, and I, like I said, I used to play this game quite a lot. There's little bits and pieces that I remember from when I was younger. Weirdly, the controls are not too bad at. I wonder, if I just kind of, like, block, will she kill them all? So if I just do that... Oh, oh, no, that's just... Maybe this isn't the best time to be doing that, it's quite a few of them. Oh, sorry, that one wasn't intentional. Sorry, Evie. Wow. Oh. Stop running away! Damn, all of these people have dynamite. Die! I, I'm actually not convinced that these are actually robbers. I mean, there's so many people down here. It may just be an excavation. <laughs> we may just be murdering an excavation. I mean, this was like, like the 30s after all. They were still using dynamite at some level. They shouldn't have been, but they were. <laughs> so... Let's try and blow one of these guys up with dynamite. Oh, that did not work. Okay, okay, so... Can I blow Eevee up with dynamite? This is not gonna work. Okay. Okay, I wanna see, can you... Blow Eevee up with dynamite. Okay, here we go. Oh! Boy, you're strong. dynamite why not um just gonna try to figure out there is a, a map and i remember the map being absolute oh that's useful that switches the camera that's actually very useful okay that's heal that one doesn't seem to do anything ah okay so okay i think we want to be going that way towards that i guess yeah. Okay, so I think is that this way? This is a horrible map. It's an atrocious map, but yeah, I'm pretty sure it's that way. The thing is you have to close it a different way than you open it as well. Okay. Oh okay. Okay, I... Okay. I am pretty sure this bit is... Alright, I know maybe you have to blow things up with dynamite, but I remember it being really, really awkward. Okay, so... Yeah, okay, so you've got to blow it up like that. And then... Oh, okay. 
Okay, we're good. Okay, I'm very glad I saved. Okay, replay area. No, we just want to load. I did mess around on this game yesterday just a bit to try and iron out things. I do know that it saves in the right area. I was a little bit worried that I'm not going to lie though. <laughs> Okay, right. You have no idea how much I'm tensing right now. <laughs> Is they even like trying to back away from the, the dynamite? Like, you, you, you're worried you're going to fall off the edge as you're doing it. Okay. I might save it here, actually. Just because that way I won't have to constantly keep... Okay, cool. Okay, jump. Good. Um, not good when you're up. Okay, do I have to... What? What? Okay. I literally just drowned in solid stone. Was that just a... Okay. Alright. Okay, oh, I'm so glad I saved it here. Okay, cool. Uh, right, so we've got the first bet. So, is this not the way I'm supposed to... Maybe I'm... Okay, so you can jump... No, okay, okay, I'm up. Okay. Oh no, no, no. Dynamite really doesn't do that much damage. <laughs> not to humans, anyway. Okay, that, that's actually not too bad. Okay, right. I might just shoot this guy because I can't really be bothered. What a terrifying villain. Okay, that was so much easier than I remember it. Okay, so I've got to get to there again. I'm just going to save it because I have a horrible feeling I'm just about to die. Why is it not giving me the option to jump now? Uh, do I... Okay, that was basically just standing on air there. Wait. Um... Wait, what? Can I just... No, if we can, we can just walk across it for a second. <laughs> so how am I supposed to get back over? Literally, do I can, like, run? Could that work? So I have a shot, right? No, I forget it's not have a shot. <laughs> no. Okay. Definition of madness, do safe again and again, but not doing that again. Okay, there's got to be another way. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> no, because then I can't jump, can I? So I might just... Okay, I can get back up. What? So... Um, uh, 
Okay, let's... We... Okay, we play... Okay, let's see if we can... I wonder if we can blow... This up. Um... I bet that said, actually, we can blow the other pillar up. Oh! Can be Oh, I just blew it up the other way. Okay. Um, okay, that didn't work. Okay, I, I did literally just do the same thing again there. Um, sort of always thinking I may have broken the game. Unless I can get on the other side and blow up that one. Why does it just not give me the option to jump? <laughs> I don't understand. Can I maybe try and blow... I can't aim that far, I don't think. Uh, let's give it a go, though. Oh, that was... Okay. Maybe. Oh! Oh! Oh, I did it! Okay. Okay. Yes. Oh, oh, okay. I can't believe I did it. Okay. Yeah. Be useful as like a way of locking on to people. It's got like no regard for anyone else's safety. Anubis and up ahead. I'll go away, you. I'll just go and get the gun out. It's going to be easier. Wait, actually, can I throw the head at them? Oh, no, okay. I just punch with the head. I'm going to head by you. This is rubbish. Oh, he's not even dead yet. This is such an ineffective, like, thing to fight with. I'm gonna win, though. Go on. Die. Okay, I think we've officially found the worst, uh... The worst, um, weapon in the game. Ahead. Oh, and I've not even got any, um, health. That's annoying. Uh, there's probably some around. Nah, there we go, as I speak. Oh, there we go. That's the one I wanted. I love the way there's just, like, no attempt of actually making any sounds match up. Like, that hit, like, fudded the ground when it was still falling. Okay, well, actually, I was about to say, I was going to go down there, but it's quite obviously got to go that way. Yeah. Oh. 
Oh, hello. You look promising. These bosses are very easy. I guess they got the mini bosses. That is the first level, I suppose. Although I seem to have died a lot for it being the first level. Okay, I think it's now time to save again because this is one of those games where you need to actually remember to save. I did try and play around with Immortep's level a bit. That's one of the things I found out quite quickly. Hey, cool, I needed that. So what's this guy, does that? Yeah, I'm intrigued. Is there a secret or something? No! This time, I saved. Doesn't matter. Okay, let's just see if we can... It does go around somewhere, doesn't it? Does it just go around back? I think it just goes around back up, but I'm intrigued. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, I'm getting too competent. Right, again. Right, so we go down there. Pow, 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 pow. Jump. I bet it's just just take you all the way around, but I, I'm at the point now where I need to know. Careful, careful. Jump. Okay, good, good. Die, 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 die. Yeah, it's just going to take me all the way around, isn't it? Back up. Yeah, that's just disappointing. Although, saying that, it has taken me to where I want, so that's fine. Thank you, thank you for your help. Okay, cool, because you couldn't possibly just open that door. Oh, hello. Okay, come out of here, come out of here. You just gonna stand there? Come here. That wall is looking a little bit. Yeah, I bet. I bet. Woo! Archaeology! Boy, I really am collecting legs. Oh, is that a different type of sword? Probably makes no difference whatsoever. A simple bronze sword built to an ancient design. Aged and worn but still devastatingly effective. It looks cooler as well, but we'll go with this one. Double the change. Did it have swing on it? Hello, Bastet. Bastet, you would not be here in this King Scorpion's tomb. Do you know Scorpion King was actually the first place we found hieroglyphs in ancient Egypt? 3200 BC, first ones from his tomb, and his tomb looked nothing like this. Chocker, I know. That might be a little bit better, actually, in fairness. Um, okay. But... What is that? I think that's supposed to be Nefertiti. <laughs> looks very manly. Okay, so we've been now. Oh, wait a minute. Was that a... Yes, okay. Convenient ammo right next to this Egyptian tomb. Okay. Oh, I think I remember this. Um, 
If I'm correct, you got like block arrows with this. So yeah, there's another like pathway somewhere that leads to like this arrow shooting thing. There's so many health packs around. I wonder if there's a boss coming up. No idea where I'm going. Oh. Yeah, and then you've got to use the shield. That's the thing, I probably look like I'm doing amazingly at this game, but like, it's just because I used to play a lot when I was younger. <laughs> I'm sort of remembering bits as I go through. It's quite nostalgic, actually. I honestly, like, it doesn't hold up as a game. I'm enjoying it, don't get me wrong, but... Yeah, I remember this. Oh, I actually annihilated that. I don't really think it needed to give me that many health. It's like, this just isn't a hard fight. And presumably this is going to take me right back to the door. Just disappears, just like that. That was really silly. But also, he can survive some absolute insane falls. I just hate the way they keep running away from you. Like, just fight me. Or, you know, just any lock-on system would be lovely. Okay, cool. Right, so now... This kid's acting. Darling, don't worry. We're all together now. We'll be safe. Do you think he's scared uh, because it's quite clear that Evie is an imposter in this game? Look. The carving suggests a sacred power greater than can be known or imagined. That's great, honey. Honey! Uh, Mum? Oh my god! It's the mythical bracelet of the Scorpion King. The Benbridge scholars said it couldn't really exist, and yet here it is. That's what they said about this guy, and yet here he is too. Evie, run! Boy, that was a good jump. I love the little painted on six back. <laughs> okay, the blunts aren't seeming to do much. Oh no, they are. But I've now run out. Okay. What if I... Oh, oh, God. Oh, whoa, okay, that... that okay. Dynamite is definitely not the way to go. Oh, 
Okay, here we go. Okay, just hit me right through me, that's fine as well. Oh, you got me. You got me. Okay, so you got done two. Oop. One, two. Oop. I'm doing so much damage, there we go. Okay, he was relatively tricky. Let's go home now, Rick. Really, I want to go home. You sure? This place has got it all. Sand, scorpions, spiders. I'd hate to just walk away from all this. Rick, don't make me beg. <laughs> it kind of feels... <laughs> <laughs> Come on. It Let's kind of feels on. like you know when someone like a kid plays with their toys with the mouse not not moving or anything. Right, so we're going to leave it there as that's kind of the end of the first level. Um if you've enjoyed this little playthrough, please do let me know because well I've really enjoyed this and I would love to do some more of these in all honesty. Uh thanks very much for watching and well, I hope to see you next time. Bye.